Dollar. I mean, when I was just straight up just a shopper come through the, to the union, you know what I'm saying, go check Mary Ann and be like, yo, let me get a discount. What up? I'm trying to cop mad stuff, you know what I'm saying? To see the dumpest St. George and the 10 Deeps and stuff like that. That's what inspired me because whatever they wasn't making, we saw a void. We was like, fuck it, let's put it out ourselves. If you lived within America within the past 20 years, if you've been to a fucking house party, you've been to a dope spot, you've been to, just been to somewhere fashionable, or you just think like basically around the individuals that hang around us and stuff like that, you're gonna basically get the concept that we put out there. I mean, you're gonna get our music, you're gonna get our lifestyle, you're gonna get the way we think, the way we eat, breathe. We're not gonna sell you nothing fake. Every single thing that we give to you is the way we, we get our sneakers, the way we let our pants sag, the way we rock our chains, the way we have our hoodies on. In fact, we don't even do hoodies no more, we do our crew necks. We wanna teach people more about not just thinking, yo, let me, let me just, yo, I seen a picture of Madonna, or I seen a picture of Biggie and Pac, let me just throw it on the shirt. We want you guys to think about how it is they inspired a culture. Give to the culture, man. A lot of cats is out here taking away from the culture. We gotta give back to the culture. We got the strawberry kiwi t-shirt and how most he really dug it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? felt it. A lot of other cats do some t-shirts and then they get cease and desist put out. We do t-shirts, cats see it, and they be like, yeah, I respect that. When you guys originally came at it, it was like, you guys were thinking, all right, we're gonna start a brand ourselves and hopefully it hits these people it's like we're just gonna start a brand and wherever it goes it goes nah i mean that's another thing a lot of people think that we just do this just winging it every single person that you see with lamar and dolly on every single other person that you see in the streets who's rocking lamar and dolly we wanted that to happen we willed that to happen you know what i'm saying we put ourselves in the best position for that to happen just like the other brands who are doing it right now it's not just something that they just all of a sudden just oh snap we popping all of a sudden you know it's hard work you put out a collection it might fail it doesn't fail, you keep it moving. You learn from your mistakes and you keep growing. And that's what we've done. You know, we make sure that we will it. If I'm gonna sign on Jay, I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go somewhere and find out who his stylist is. Or you know what? I'm gonna be in the clubs. Jay's doing a performance all of a sudden. He's trying to introduce a new artist. Best believe I'm gonna be at that club. I'm gonna be right there with a bag of t-shirts like yo, what's good? This shit is a grind. I mean, we're all t-shirt companies. We're t-shirt sweatshirts, we're all starting, you know, the factories are starting to see our vision a little bit more, so they open it up, they're allowing us to do more cutting sold, allow come out with jackets, hats, stuff like that. But at the end of the day, you got these other companies at the Ralph Lawrence, they've been had these factories online. In fact, they don't even use factories. They got their own shit right now, you know what I'm saying? They doing, yeah, you know what I'm saying? There's a reason why they 300 men. So at the end of the day, you can't just think all of a sudden we getting the popping now because we got t-shirts. So my question now is like marketability or credibility? It has to be both. You can't sacrifice one or the other. You have to have both. At the end of the day, I tell a lot of people, if you don't start a t-shirt brand, <coughs> excuse me, Everybody can start a t-shirt brand. What keeps us all in the race is who wants to make sure that they last 20 years down the line.